What's up, Facebook? All right. So a new barbecue joint opened up um, around our way. And um, it's right around the corner from where we live in So I said, oh, I'm going to go check them out. Uh, <clears throat> go give them a try. So the very first time I went there, I got there at about 5 o'clock. And um, the young lady said, oh, I'm sorry, we're closing. And we just wasn't getting too much action. So uh, we, 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 uh, we're we we going to close up today. I said, it's only 5 o'clock. She said, I'm sorry. Yeah, come back another day. So that was about maybe three, four weeks ago. So today I said, well, I'm going to go give them a try. I'm going to go try their food today. So I go there today and I place my order for uh, me and Joanne's dinner for tonight. Because we kind of tired of having turkey. <clears throat> Why do I do this to myself? I, I don't know why I do it to myself. I don't know why I do it to myself. All right. Let me show you what I get. I wanted, first of all, I asked them if they had a sample of platter because I wanted to be able to sample all the meats that they had. They barbecued it. Speaking of which. You know what just don't They ain't giving me my little barbecue pork slider. They ain't even giving me my little barbecue pork sandwich. Dog on it. I'm joking. They didn't give me that. They didn't give me my barbecue pork slider. Now I'm mad. Now I'm out. All right. I'm going to try to call. All right. Let me show you what I got. Let me show you what I got. Turn around, phone. And those are supposed to be ribs. Them things ain't seen lick, nade lick of a grill. And they call themselves a barbecue joint. It takes more than barbecue sauce to be a barbecue restaurant. It takes more than barbecue sauce to be a barbecue restaurant. Now ask for a portion of brisket. That's the brisket. This looks like bacon to me. Why in the world? What kind of... This looks like bacon. It's greasy like bacon. And I asked for some brisket stiff like bacon. Come on now. Come on. And this supposed to be brisket. This is probably jerky. And that's $27 right there. That's $27. Well, not where I got Joanne's meal too, so... Um, but it's a lot. Still, that's a lot. Now, I, now I played it safe with her. I just got her pork chops, macaroni and cheese, and some um, yams. But I guess that's all right. But my meal, uh, I can see all that fat right here. I ain't gonna be hitting no much of nothing because just pure fat. So I ain't, I ain't, ain't gonna be much of nothing. That's supposed to be dirty rice, and that's supposed to be cabbage. But look at that, and that's supposed to be brisket, y'all. That's supposed to be brisket, and it looks and it's looking like bacon. Come on now, if you're gonna call yourself a barbecue place and get all on the internet talking about you got a, you got the best smoked brisket in town and all that other kind of stuff. Come on, you can't be doing this kind of stuff. What is this? That's bacon. That look like bacon. Beef bacon. That's probably what that is. Okay, Christ, now I'll give them a, I'll tip my hat with the sauce that they got. Tastes pretty good. I'll give them their props on the sauce. It's all right. But come on now. Don't, don't, don't have a person work all day long. Come and want something. They got their mouth set for some barbecue. And all you're going to do is pull some sauce over some... Look at that. Come on. Come on. What is this? Do I got to turn my thing? Yeah, can they sit on closer? 6.30. So I might run up there and fuss about my, having my um, slider sandwich. Man, that don't make no sense. Look at this. Mm, mm, mm. All right, Facebook. If you're going to have yourself a barbecue joint, A, 
put the thing on the grill. Put some wood and smoke and charcoal on your food. Don't just throw, run it in the oven. And pour a gallon of Sweet Baby Ray's on it and then say it's barbecue. Then sit down and get on the internet to when it's the best barbecue in town. And how your grandmama gave you the secret recipe and all this other kind of craziness. Come on. And that's... That's beef jerky right there. Now, that, that, that ain't right. That is not brisket. I know what brisket look like. And then, that's the sad part. You probably think I'm some dummy that don't know what brisket is. I, I, uh, I, 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 uh, Matt, I was going to, I just wanted to try their pulled pork and ask them for a pulled pork slider sandwich. I'm just realizing they ain't put that in my bag. Um, yeah, I got a few minutes. I'm going to run up there and take this back and just, I don't know what I'm going to say to them, but I don't want to be too hard on the people, but my God, yeah, my grandmama taught me how to barbecue and gave me the special sauce and all this other stuff and blase, blase. Then you get in there and this is what they give you. Come on now, going to take more than a sad song and dance. That's right, man. It looks like bacon. And it's supposed to be brisket. And I said, give me some brisket. Beef brisket. And this thing looked like bacon. Oh, man. All right, y'all. I'm running up there. All right, now I can't cuss them out. <laughs> but um, I'm going back up there. All right, I'll holler at y'all. Let me go and get up there before they close. They close, supposed to close at 630. I'll be back. I'll holler. I'm back, y'all. <clears throat> I went and took the uh, other plate back. I was just too disappointed to try to get anything else. It was supposed to be barbecue. I did with my pulled pork slider. <clears throat> I got the pulled pork slider. Slider. I'm mad. Um, turn the camera around. Uh, turn the camera around. This is the pulled pork slider right here. This is some of the pulled pork. Pulled pork. This is some of the pulled pork. This thing ain't seen no smoker. Uh, why do people say it's, uh, it takes more than barbecue sauce? This ain't even crock pot. Man, now I'm trying to give the people a break. Because you want to support your community. And this is not... It's not even crock pot pulled pork, bro. That ain't even crock pot pulled pork. No smoke whatsoever. So, if you're going to sell a pork, if you're going to sell ribs and something that's supposed to be brisket and barbecue, call it. If you're going to call it, don't call it, don't, I don't know. It's just crazy. I just want to, don't, I don't know. Just crazy. I tried to, uh, I said I won't going to get anything that's poor, poor. I won't going to get anything that was supposed to be so-called barbecue. But uh, I got the pork, fried pork chop sandwich and macaroni and cheese and sweet potatoes. Mm, so, so. Okay, all right. So, so. It's all right. But that, the, Anything on the menu that's supposed to be barbecue, it just ain't it. It's just not it. And I know better, <clears throat> especially when you do, when you make barbecue and I guess you're a cook or whatever, you just get disappointed and you go to these places and my grandmama taught me how to cook when out on the farm in North Carolina and... Then you say, okay, well, I guess it's going to be all right. I'll go give it a try. 
and then it's something that ain't seen no smoke, no fire, no nothing. It ran in the oven. And then it just opened up a bottle of something and poured it over it. I don't know, man. I don't know. That's just... And then people going in there and paying for it. And that's why I'm sitting there scratching my head. I'm turning the phone back around. People going in there paying for it. And saying, I'm, I'm just saying, I'm saying, they think this is really, and they say, oh yeah, this is good. This is good. This is good. And I'm like, huh? Scott, it ain't even crock pot. It won't even crock pot, Scott. It won't even, that's not even crock pot. I don't know what that is. That's not even crock pot. It would be a little bit more tender uh, if it was crock pot, but I don't even think that's crock pot. Poor pork, Scott. And people in there paying for it, and that's what got me. Man. Mm. I don't know. I guess I'm eat this B-rated food and watch my B-rated movie and call it an evening. And um anyway. Oh, but I oh let me I uh, I guess on a good news front. Uh I got my two seventy smoker. Uh it came um it got messed up during shipment during shipment. So I was talking to uh, Stephanie West via email. So um <clears throat> they're gonna come down and fix the part that got messed up, which I think is pretty cool customer service. And speaking of, I, I will say that for this particular place that I went to, at least the people were, uh, they tried their best to make up for the meal. They tr I give them their marks for that. They tried their best to make up for it um, with their customer service. Um, they offered a free drink and gave me a free dessert for having to wait and bringing the meal back. <clears throat> so, and they were, didn't give me no hassle about that. But um, but anyway, the two seventy smoker, um, Stephanie, and um, them they emailed me and said they would come down to fix my smoker, and and um, I thought that was great customer service too. So, um, anyway, I thought that was great. All right, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna eat this B-rated meal, watch my B-rated movie, and um, call it and like I just had to share this. So, uh. uh Man, all right, y'all. I don't. Just sad, 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 sad. It takes more than barbecue sauce for it to be barbecue. Remember that it takes more than just somebody pouring some sweet baby rays or or craft or KC masterpiece on a piece of meat and then say, "Oh, this is barbecue." It takes more than that, y'all. It takes it takes a little bit more than that. It really does. All right. Kirby out. Y'all have a blessed evening. Yeah, you're right. Uh, uh, Scott, they seem to be great people. The West do seem to be great people from my communi communications with them so far. All right, I'm out. Y'all be blessed. Take it easy. <laughs>